my life just stop again. Okay. I'm sorry, have I done something wrong? Tell me, do you have no custom or relatives of the deceased may say their final farewells? <sighs> Not really. How could we have on Dana up until we were sending? Are people would be see you toiling away to think of burial rites? Hmm. Well, Ryan and his custom are ready for relatives to send their remains out into the heavens. Why not introduce such a practice to them? I believe that in doing so, the deceased spirit shall join the flow of astral energy of the rest of us. We could never do something like that. So that's chance for the grief to see their loves, loved ones. Surely something should be done to one another. That is part of everyday living for us, Stannins. You really think we're going to ship bodies into space somehow every single day? I simply felt that something more ought to be done. <coughs> the Rena still ruled over us, we didn't even know if it was safe to build few sites. As bodies come in homes, they can spread diseases. We didn't have any other choice in how we could bury our people. Where you going? <laughs> Don't think. I'll take for a second of keep giving everything that Rana did to us. Tell me, Afra, do you know why none of us have last names like them? Let me tell you why. It's because we are not under them. They denied us of our, our culture to stop us from uniting against them. Enough. Mm. The people steal so much from us as it is, and on top of that you have the call to try and make us think like you do. If you hate it here so much, why don't you just turn them all home? Uh -huh. It's enough. Uh -huh. No more. Let it just get struck at any time. We are going to help ourselves. We're all well aware of the sound of and hatred with each, each harbor. If it's where going to coexist, we have to recognize each other's differences. Hmm. That's what we're all working together to achieve. To bring an end to this whole system, we begin to live together side by side. That's what I believe, and that's why I'm here. If any of you think differently, they'd be like us and leave. Break down every last barrier, even if I have to do it alone. <sighs> Indeed. Sincerely apologize. Consider your true friend. But it would appear that I have yet to hear from you. Are people dark, people's darkest day in the list? I'm afraid not. When will I completely accept the blame in all of this? Words cannot express how very sorry I am for clicking. Me so deeply. I'm sorry. I'm sorry of that, for lashing you out. But you as hard as I did though. I guess I'm still working through a lot of emotions. I know you were only thinking about what was best for our son too. Rinwell. Rinwell, I'd like you to teach me about the culture of this side of this plan. Perhaps that will help us begin to preach together. Huh? Oh, sure, don't mind. Could you please teach me about Rena too, please? <sighs> you two are more alike than you realize sometimes. I'm glad you're able to patch things up. Plus enough good people along the way as it is. Hmm? Ah, sorry for the disruption. Let's lay your son to rest. We'll do it the dining room. Good. Yes. <clears throat> so, thank you. Thank you for granting me that task. Mention it is the last we could do for you as a small. Well, because of all of you, my, my son is at least. Right. Rest assured, intend to build a future for this world that would make him glad. That little speech you gave back there was pretty impressive, Alfin. If you call letting your emotions get the better of you impressive, sure. It made them stop fighting with each other, right? However you managed it, you knocked some sense into Rinwell and Dohalim, and that mother. Yeah. I can see my decision to travel with you was well made. <laughs> Something's eating at you again, huh? I don't know if I would say that. I just... I mean... <sighs> Actually, I guess I do have one or two things on my mind. My, my people, we lived in hiding, so we never really experienced the full extent of Renan oppression. 
Not directly, anyway. After Almadria killed my mother and father, though, I... I guess that's when I started hating them so much. The Renans, I mean. But then I think of all those people who were born into slavery. The ones who never even got angry in the first place because it was all they ever knew. I hear you. Every city we've been to, it's the resistance that gets labeled the troublemakers for having the guts to do the right thing. When it comes down to it, sometimes I wonder which of us really has the better way. You can't let your anger eat away at you, Rinwell. But then again, losing your parents that way. Hell, who could really blame you for it if you did? <laughs> I guess what I'm trying to say is... Uh, sorry. Hell, it's hard putting this stuff into words. No, I get it. You're saying that grief and anger are different than hatred. I never thought of it like that. But hearing you say it, it makes sense. Thanks, Law. Uh, you're welcome? I think we've helped these people just about as much as we can. They're going to need more long-term aid than we can provide on our own. You're right. We need to ask the other realms to send help, and fast. Another reason to hurry and find a way out of Ganeth Haros. Uh, agreed. We'll start looking for a way out tomorrow. For now, we should spend the day resting up while we can. Th thanks for our hard work for the rest of the What? Were they attacking? I think they were attacking. What's that noise? Helping, this is bad! Look at the sky! Huh? Oh, that's the I guess. It's a spaceship. What? Siphon. What's happening to Rena and Lenigus? It looks like Lenigus is transforming? But into what? What's going on? 
How the hell are we supposed to fight the Renans if they're packing that kind of arsenal? It seems they've broken their silence at last. My concern is that object they've dropped into the water. It's as if they're driving a literal wedge into Dana. Not just into Dana, but her own resistance, too. And what's with that beam of light coming down from above? Got any idea what that could be? Astral energy. Are you serious? All of that is astral energy? But that... It's a lot for sure. Not even all the astral energy harvested by every lord combined compares to that column. They're trying to squeeze every last bit of energy out of the planet. But, but why? I thought they only needed to harvest astral energy as part of the crown contest. Who cares? If we don't stop it now, the whole of Dana is going to be hollowed into oblivion. Uh, oblivion. Do you think that red woman is behind this? It certainly wouldn't surprise me. Just as the Sovereign, the Maiden, and all five Master Corps are gathered in one location, she appears out of nowhere bearing a sixth core. She then forces the two of you to help her assemble the Renis Alma. Just what kind of person is this woman? Y you mean you don't know her? P pardon? She was there at your palace, wasn't she? I figured you knew who she was. Are you saying I should be familiar with this woman? Well, well, sure. I remember seeing her with you back at Ottolina Palace several times. Everyone in the Guard always wondered who she was. Now that you mention it, I remember seeing her with Balsif, too. You saw her, right, Shion? Shion? Oh, sorry. I drifted off. As far as I remember, the first time I saw her was when we ran into her in Pelegian. Seriously? How could you two not notice her before? She sticks out like a sore thumb. Don't see I her. guess I always figured she kept an eye on the lords for the Renan top brass. You're sure you don't remember ever seeing her before? I'm certain of it. My memory has never failed me. But if it's not that, then... We'll get to the bottom of this later. Right now, that wedge is a bigger concern. Well, what are we gonna do then? We're not going to be able to leave Ganeth Haros until we come up with a plan, right? Cislodia lies beyond the northern mountain range. Yeah, but we haven't found a single route through those mountains while we've been here. And we haven't gotten clues from any of the freed locals either. Surely there must be a way through. This realm can't have been completely isolated from the rest of the outside world for 300 years. Volron may have simply sealed and hidden it. Okay. Then let's try asking the townspeople again if they know anything. Who knows? We might have missed something the first time around. Sounds good to me. Better that than trying to build a boat from scratch. Let's start searching. That must be Rena's true power. I imagine there would be something, but not to this extent. What's gonna happen now? We ask around. Let's do what we can. Hey, when that wedge dropped down on Dana, did anyone else see any weird light shoot out with it? Indeed. As I recall, it was four lights, each one a different color and going in a separate direction. Th that's what I saw, too. What were they? Uh, hold on. A lot just happened here, so let's take a minute. For now, let's focus on one thing at a time. I bet the whole of Dan is losing its mind right about now. And just when we'd finished liberating all the realms. So much for things getting somewhere close to normal. It's too calculated. As if whoever's behind all this was watching us. The people of Pelegian seem pretty unfazed given the circumstances. They've yet to get the full range of their emotions back. Maybe it's for the best. Can you imagine the panic otherwise? Yeah. We wouldn't have been able to leave. That's for sure. Whatever Lenegus is planning, it's a fair bet this wedge they've sent down is just the beginning. Even now, they're stealing away Dana's astral energy as we speak. Come on, we don't have much time. Alright, let's go. That thing dropped out of Lenegus, the sound. Oh my, oh my, I thought the mountains were collapsing.
trying to find a way out to the other realms? I can't say I've ever heard about anything. If we knew about anything like that, we wouldn't have had to hunger down in this this thing. This thing. Trying to get to the other realms without a sturdy bolt. There isn't much, much you can. Wait, and take that back. Remember, one of the elders who recently started talking a little mentioned. A little? Talking a little mentioned something. Apparently, back in the day, there used to be a way to get through Foreland Mountains, but not anymore. What could it have been? Okay. Where are these Foreland Mountains exactly? Those are the mountains you encounter if you walk deep enough into the Loftu marshland. I don't remember there being any sort of path like that around there. It's possible we overlooked something before. It wouldn't hurt to look again. Okay. Oh. Huh. Oh. There are more quests. Turned on the... Looks like we made it here in one piece. I think there's someone in trouble. Mm. No way. Not the is that you? You're found in the home. All right. Forgive me. I do believe you have a strong person. My name is Dolin. So it happens as it so happens. I'm new to this area. <sighs> oh, are you the ones who drove out those circuits? I'm sorry, my mistake. Hmm. Fred, that it appears there's something troubling you. It's not too much to ask. Would you mind telling me a little about this naughty fellow of yours? Hmm. I can't. I. It's very hard to discuss. As you can see, we're but a roving, roving band of misfits. We've seen much of our troubles, so we don't shop with hmm. In that case, my name is Kagari. Not the my lover, only he's a runner. You don't oh. say. See, I can understand why you were so hesitant then. I think it's something happened to him. I went to several months ago. We used to meet in a secret out of the village. Ever since then, he hasn't returned. <sighs> Sounded completely normal last time. So I don't know what's going on. Or not you, whatever might have happened to him. Anyway, he works as a guard in Bel Belgium. Belgium? It's Belgium. I'm afraid he might have. Stay well, calm. Stay calm. There could be many a number of reasons why he hasn't returned. I narrate your story intrigues me. I feel personally invested now. We shall investigate this ourselves and get to the bottom of it. Huh? Really? You did that for me? Good. Gladly, let this matter to us. For now, we shall make our way to Pelagia. Pelagia. Any records to find there should tell us just where you went. Good idea. Hmm. That we shall be on our way. With any luck, we should have good news before. Sure. That. Yes, thank you. Wait, I forgot. Perhaps you shouldn't have gotten your hopes up. I felt moved by people whose love transcended the boundaries of race. I wanted to hope. I can see why you'd feel that way, I suppose. Okay, uh... Get the ingredient, then turn side quest, and then finally, if only we could have flown with. I need to, right? Once you guys appear to attack your lifestyle, a big. Why? Why did you attack my rap pig? Oh, 
friends to the enemies. We can buy the chain. Hey, look! We've got way more animals! I never imagined Law would have a knack for husbandry. Makes sense since they're on the same wavelength. What? <laughs> You're making me blush over here. Law, maybe you should consider what that statement actually means. It's that green quest here. Uh, we finally made it. Hello. We meet again, Gun. See you're still in well. You people again. Don't worry, I haven't gone hungry since then. I've been thinking though about what it takes to believe in trust in me. I see. It's a rather profound question to contemplate. Forgive us for interrupting you in the middle of all that. However, looking for something missing can your records of purple. But the run on forces may have been maintained. Can you think where they may have kept such things? Hmm. Records like this? Oh. Yes, exactly like those. Thank you. Save us a considerable amount of time. It's fine. Trust you won't do anything bad with them. Hmm. Let's see, not you, not you. Ah, here we are. What? Ishan, determining Lord Fallen's whereabouts. Last night's mission received from men and sea. Ah. Uh. communication was cut off and has been doing for some time. This hardly boots well. Hmm. It's obviously an in easy enough region for us to look for him, but whatever we'll find him is Oh? Wait, judging by this location, could that soldier I met by the pond have been him? I see. Might well be on the something ship. May I ask you to get us? Yeah. Thing? Sure, but you'll owe me one later. The pond? But why Voron's whereabouts? Don't they know where their own sovereign is? Considering we've come across him the world over, he's likely been operating on his own for a while now. Maybe even his own subordinates were just toys to him. Uh, let's finish these two side quests. Just get up here. Hey man. Yes. Well, it's about time. Well, it should be everything the recipe asks for. Hmm. Yes, I see rice, spices, raw pig meat, and it's the other white, soft and fluffy thing. Right. Yeah, it's called tough. Partially, make it by taking the liquid from soy beans and solidifying. Very nice. Oh. Fascinating. I can't wait to see how this tastes. I know, I'm really curious. I had a lot of trouble bringing this stuff back without shame to steal it. Eating. Yes! Well, here's the recipe. Go ahead and fix this mambo card. So we can find out what it's supposed to be. Right! Right! We got right. Just a minute. Put your house aside, then. I'll decide how much spice we put in. We'll let you decide that there are whole, whole floors. Mm -hmm. That's fine. All right, it's done. I made sure to give she an extra dose. So. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I've got that beautiful dish. It smells just as divine too. Now to see how it tastes. What? Oh, this is yes. exalting, fulfilling, liberating. <laughs> Absolutely exquisite. I'm in heaven. This masterpiece is surely the key to realizing real peace. Great. So basically, you really liked it. That's what I'm getting here. Whew. Great. Then let's get on ahead and you're already eating. Oh shit. Mm. Mm. The rich. Mm. <laughs> Different spices complement each other and this soft mild off gives a nice texture. Hey! Don't you think this is great, great too, Alpha? No way! Oh no, this is bad. Oh? But I thought they like spicy. It's really bad. Yeah. 
pretty much stop hey. <laughs> Stop it's very right. so. I'm I'm sorry. How? Parsing D Amazing. sorry, but this is hard to put into words just how good this is. Makes me want to get up and jump for joy. <laughs> oh ho, now you're starting to understand what I've been trying to teach you. Never would have imagined such an overwhelming dish could ever exist. Can you really feel myself getting addicted to it? Yes! Oh I see. This may very well be why it was planted to from the recipe we just passed. Perhaps even great wars were fought over it. Or perhaps not. Like they not. The more I think about it. Hey. Pretty much sure you don't need too much of this stuff, Shim, or you might forget it. Be fine. Besides, I prefer to eat it with bread. So what? So what? What's the difference? Though? Very nice. Completely and utterly satisfied. You can leave this round with the lights. Having now visited the shop, the rooms, I'm not sure what the trouble is. <laughs> the sense of each other is together. Stay in the next time. We've been learning this. This man. Shion stuffing bread with mago curry! <laughs> now I can eat this every day. Jeez, Shion, you're hooked on that stuff. Okay, uh... Just yeah, go here and then end my stream. Bye. We've reached. So I'm level thirty-eight, I guess. Oh, 37. Okay. Our destination. That's it.